like honestly, that was to me was oh, over the years. Know, I've the met best other moment of my comedy career, really. But I, to meet him. I love those moments where you you meet somebody who's kind of famous and you have this question that you want to ask him. You're not sure. Oh, are they going to think I'm a douchebag for asking this? But uh, my one of my moments happened on a on a flight uh, to Indianapolis, and I found myself sitting next to the lead guitarist for uh, John Cougar Mellencamp's band. Wow. Mm. Yeah, and I was doing the Bob and Tom show out of there, mm. and so yeah. and he from Indy knew what the Bob and Tom show was, and I had this little thing about with some Bob and Tom letterhead on it, and he goes, "Oh, you like the Bob and Tom show?" I go, "Yeah, I'm actually going to go." Do that, and that's how we struck up the conversation. Oh, wow. Of did you oh, know it was him? Did you know no, no, no. Oh, wow. And he goes, "Oh, I've been on that show a lot." I go, "Really? What do, what do you do? Are you a comic?" He goes, "No, no, I'm I'm John Mellencamp's guitar player. Been with him for 25, 30 years, whatever it was." Wow. And immediately had this one question I had. I and I thought, oh, "Is this going to be okay?" And I go, "I go, well, are you, okay. I I got to ask you this question after we had talked for a while. Yeah. Like, I got to ask you this. I don't mean I don't mean to. I hope this is okay, but." Do you guys have a song call that went like, I need a lover that won't drive me crazy? He goes, yeah, yeah, that's us. I go, okay, because I was just a little kid when I heard that song. Did you ever do it on a TV show where you were playing the ba a stand-up bass on a rope, like, like a normal guitar, but it was a huge stand-up bass? And he just busted out laughing. He goes, "Yes!" Oh, wow. He's, they they told us before the show that they that we should just lip sync because they were gonna do a tape cue for the whole thing, and it would sound better if we just lip synced, and then they would play the original recording. And we didn't have a choice in the matter, so we all went back there and said, "Well, if we're gonna lip sync, why should we play our normal instruments?" <laughs> so we we scrounged around the music area. I got a bass that and held it like this. <laughs> I don't know if you noticed, John was playing like a like a, a, a ukulele type thing, <laughs> and the drummer had uh, mic stands as his, oh you know. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's awesome. That's cool. I think.